guys and welcome to the workout video. So today um, our workout is for beginners. Um, I put together a sequence of six exercises that you can do to help you with your Kung Fu training. So I've kind of focused it on the Wu Bu Chuan, so on the first form. So these exercises you can practice are going to really help you to develop your Wu Bu Chuan, your Wu Bu Chuan training, okay? So we've got six exercises. I'm going to show you them step by step um, and then we're going to practice them together. We're going to do five reps, eight reps, and ten reps, and we're going to do three sets of those each time. But before we do that, let's do a warm up. So, wrists and ankles. So, put your fingers together like this, and you're going to circle your wrists around, and at the same time, you're going to rotate your ankle. So, this is really important to make sure you warm up all of your joints before we begin, so you don't have any injuries or anything like that. Okay, good, and change. Okay, good, and stretch up. So keep your arms straight above your head. Straight, and lean back slightly. Very good, and then lean over to the side. Keep your arms straight here, over to the side. Okay, good, and then change to the other side. So when you're here, really push away with your hand. Keep your arms straight, push, push away. Okay, very good. And this time, link your fingers together and you're just gonna stretch down to the floor. And you're keeping your legs straight at the back. So stretch down, opening up the muscles in your back. Okay, move over to one side, grab your foot. Okay, work your head down towards your leg. And then move your hands to the other side. Grab your foot. And stretch down. Okay. Very good. So we're going to warm up our waist. So feet shoulder width apart, just rotate your hip around. <laughs> good, and then change. Okay, good, and knees together. And rotate your knees around. Okay, and change. And then we're going to squat down. So from here, you're just going to squat your knees down. And then open up your back, hug your knees. Okay, and then from here, push your knees straight. And then squat down again. Hug your knees again. Okay, and then push your legs straight one more time. Okay, from here, try to get your head down to your shin, uh, your head to your shin. Legs straight. Okay, very good, and then slowly up. Okay, relax your arms. <laughs> So from here, rotate your shoulders forward, and then backwards, and then your arms forward, and then backwards, and then we're going to go one forward, one back, good, and change, okay, good, that's all you need to do for your joints warm up today. We're going to be doing a few stretches afterwards to cool yourself down because your body's going to be quite hot as well after this training. So we can utilize that and make sure we really stretch out our body afterwards. Okay, so I'm going to show you six exercises step by step. I'm just going to show you a few of them and then we're going to go through them together. Okay, so the first exercise we're going to do is to help you with your arm strength. So some of you out there might not be able to do push up just yet. So what we're going to do is help to build up your arms really slowly, step by step. So for this exercise, you just need to put your hands down to the floor like this in a push-up position. And we're not going to do push-up, but you're going to go down onto your elbow, like that, make sure your body's straight, and then you're going to come up onto your hands. Yep, so this is just working your body and just working your shoulders and just getting your body strong enough to be able to do that push up uh, later on, okay? When you've done that, it doesn't stop there. So when you've done that, you're gonna do mini jumps on the spot. So from there, you're gonna just jump your body up off the floor. This is gonna help you with your explosive power. So when you wanna do your punches, you're gonna be able to have that power to be able to push out, okay? So that's the second exercise, is the little mini jumps on the spot. Then the exercise after that is for your abdominals. So you're going to lie down on the floor, um, like so. Your hands above your head, 
and then you're gonna V sit up. So you're gonna sit up your arms and your body at the same time and your hands are gonna come and slap the top of your feet, yeah? So your two hands, you need to point your toe and as you sit up, your hands are gonna slap the top, yeah? So from here, if you just watch, you're gonna go up and then down. When you do this exercise, make sure that you are arms are straight, your legs are straight, and that your hands finish off on the floor. Yeah, so from here, you're gonna go up, and then down, and then up, and then down. Make sure you slap the top of your foot. Don't flex your foot like this, because you won't be able to hit your foot. Okay, very good. Okay, so the next exercise we're gonna do, um, we're gonna do a Marbu. So you know this exercise, you've done this before. So Marbu squat down. So you're gonna squat your leg, this is obviously for your leg strength. Squat down like this, you're gonna stand up, your hands up like in a stand up position, and you're gonna push, push. Yeah? So you're gonna squat down, then up, push, push. When you push forward, make sure you raise your knee up, flex your toe up towards you, and then push your leg straight. Yeah, and you're just gonna change leg each time, yeah? So number one would be squat, push, push. That would be number one. We're gonna do five sets of these, okay? So the next one we're gonna do uh, is gonna practice um, your leg positioning from Marbu to Gumbu. So this is your Gumbu position, and you're gonna change it Marbu, and then Gumbu. Then Marbu, Gumbu, Marbu, Gumbu, Marbu, Gumbu. Yeah, so make sure your feet are facing forward for Marbu. Turn your foot out and change to Gumbu position. Your legs straight and your back straight. Then you change to Marbu again and then change to Gumbu. Make sure your back is straight in this position. Okay, after we've done that, our sixth one is to help with your calf, yeah? So we did our arm explosive power. So now you're gonna work on your calf for explosive power. So you're gonna go up, on your tiptoes like this, up on your tiptoes, and then down again, and then up, and then down, up and down. We're not gonna do too many of these, okay? So, six exercises. I'm gonna do five reps the first time, then eight, then 10. I'm gonna do three sets all together, okay? Are you ready? Are you ready to start this with me? Okay, so let's start in the push-up position. So let's go for this. First one. So we've got five of these. Okay, ready? And go. One, two, three, four, five. Good. Okay, five small jumps. Go. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, from here, just see if you can do this. You go. Scooch your legs through and lie down. Yeah, that was a bit nifty, huh? <laughs> okay. So from here, you're gonna V sit up five times. Okay, ready? Go up one and two and three and four and five. Okay, very good. Stand up. From here, Marbu front push. So put your hands up. Squat down, one, sh, sh, two, sh, sh, three, sh, sh, four, sh, sh, five. Ash, ash. Okay, very good. Marble Gumbu change. So Gumbu, get your legs really wide. So, one, sh, two, sh, three. Okay, good. Now to your heel raises, hands behind your back, slowly up, one, and down. Two, up, hold it, and down. Three, up, and down. Four, up, and down. And five, up, and down. And just when you think it's over, no, we're gonna do 20 really fast. Okay, ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, very good, relax. Okay, get your energy back. If you feel tired, there are some really great ways that you can get your energy back together. So one way is using your breathing. So by breathing in really, really deeply. So, and then breathing out. This really helps you to regulate your energy in your body. So you can use your hands, breathe in and breathe out. And then again, breathe in and breathe out. Good, so, and sometimes you can just move around as well. So you can move around and walk about just so you can try to get your uh, pulse rate back down a little bit lower, okay? Okay, are you guys ready? You ready to do a second set? Yes, yes you are. Okay, right, let's do this. Okay, push up position again. So this time we're upping it to eight. Okay, eight of everything. Here we go. So, one, two. You can alternate hands each time. Three. Four, keep your tummy tight. Five, six, seven, eight. Get ready for your mini jumps. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, ready? Scoot your legs through. Lie down. Here we go. Eight V sit ups. One, two, three. Okay, very good. Up you get. Marbu front push, two front push. Okay, you ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Okay, very good. Relax your body. Next one, marble boom change. Let's get that boom really low. Back straight. One, two, sharp movement. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, heel raises, hands behind your back, go up and down, one, two, three, four, five, really stretch up, six, seven, eight, up, hold it, Okay, let's add another 10. Let's do 30 heel raises. Okay, ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15, 16, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Whoa. Yes, can definitely feel your calf. Okay, brilliant. Take a few moments just to relax. Get your energy back, have a sip of water if you need to. We're just gonna take a few moments here just to chill, okay? <laughs> you could do more than like three sets, right? <laughs> we can do like 10 sets if you want, <laughs> no problem. <laughs> yeah, only joking, okay. Right, so next one, we're gonna do 10 sets, okay? So really try and put your effort into it. When we do the front push, really push your hip forward. So when we do this squat down, and then up and really push your hip forward as you do that front push. Put all your power into it, okay? When you change from marble to boom boom, make sure it's like bump, shot, bump, shot, bump, bump, yeah? So each movement is really, really sharp and really tense. You really hold that position each time, okay? Okay, this is your last set, guys. Put all of your effort into it, all of your power. Let's really go for it this time, okay? So, push up position. We're gonna go down into our plank. 10 sets, okay, you ready? Yeah, easy. Okay, let's do this. Okay, go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You notice we're speeding up a bit? Okay, jump. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Scooch through. Ten V sit ups, go. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good, up again. Marble front push, ten sets. Ready? Hands up. Let's do this. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go. Ready? Breathe in, out, two, out, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, good, ten, hold it. Next one, 40. Really push those heels up. Okay, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Last one. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow. Yes. Well done, guys. Really good. So yeah, you should be feeling whew, a little bit warm now, but that's really good. You've worked really hard, okay? So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this opportunity, because our body's warm and hot, we take this opportunity to cool down, but also to stretch at the same time. So in the Wubu Chuen, you have five stances. The first one is a gumbu. Yeah, we did this in our walk. So stretch here. One, two, three, four, Five, and change the other side. One, two, three, four, five. Pubu, low stance. Because your body, all your muscles are engaged, it's a really great time to stretch. Yeah. Okay, and then change the other side. So changing should be a lot easier as well because you can really feel all those muscles engaged. Pubu. Okay, Mabu. So from here, in a Mabu position, lean your body slightly forward, turn your feet out and push your hips out. Try and get your hip towards the floor. This is gonna really help getting your Mabu lower, yeah? Okay, good. Stand up. Shabu. So here, you're gonna cross your leg behind. Sit down on the floor. Good. Just really relax your body, let your hips sink down. Remember your Wubu Chuen, what? Punch, block, punch. This is the stance called a shell. Okay, good, stand up, cross the other leg behind and squat down. Good, really squeeze your thighs together as you stand up, you'll get more stability that way. Okay, last exercise, Shubu. Good, and change. This is a warm down, remember, so. Okay, fantastic, good guys. 
One last exercise that I think will be really good just to help stretch your legs a little bit further. We're going to sit down onto the floor. So from here, just open your legs out. Okay, we're going to use breathing to help us stretch our body. So from here, you're going to put your hands in front of you. You're going to breathe in. And as you breathe out, you're going to stretch forward. Make sure your toes are facing the sky. So as far as you can go, if you can go to here, that's absolutely fine. If you can go to here, that's really good. But what you're aiming for is your body, your forehead to touch the floor. And if you're super flexible, you can put your whole body flat on the floor. That'll be really great. Okay, so let's do some exercise here. So breathe in and breathe out. Okay, hold it. Breathe in and breathe out. Look forward. And breathe in and out. Okay, well done. Okay, bend your knees in. Just relax your hip down. Okay. Very good, guys. So that is the end of our Kung Fu workout. For our beginner's Kung Fu workout. If you want to make the exercises harder, you, you know, you can do more reps. So instead of the three, you can do maybe four, eight, ten, however, however many that you can do it to max. Um, also with the exercises, you can make them harder um, by increasing the intensity. So you could do it faster and you can use more power. Um, but next time, this one is mainly for beginners. So the exercises are really to help you to build up your strength in your arms, your arms, your core, and your legs. So this is really for beginners to really help you. Um, and then the next stage, we're gonna really work on making the exercises a lot harder. Um, so we increase the, we increase the difficulty um, as the weeks go on. Okay, good. Let's stand up and let's finish off for today. Okay, so from here, you're gonna take three deep breaths in. You're gonna breathe in and breathe out try to relax your body okay and breathe in and breathe out last time breathe in and out okay well done guys, you did really, really good. Excellent effort. Okay, if you've enjoyed this tutorial, then um, leave some comments, let me know how you got on. If it was too easy, too difficult, or you want more, then just send me a message and let me know. Um, my name is Shifu Martin, and I will see you next time. Thank you, shortcut, class finish. Hop.